Hi everyone, welcome back to Deck and Fire with Slick. So today we're actually going to be doing two WhatsApp chicks, axe, and cracks. Check this out. I'll be right back. Archive and on archives, please show receipt and on receipt on your own personal sticker and you can send me to people while you're shouting amazing stuff. So make sure you stick to the end of this video and see all the exciting stuff about amazing tricks Act and crack on WhatsApp. Say no more, I'll be right back. The first thing we're actually going to talk about is archive and on archive so now you can actually archive some of your shots and also on archive them so before when you archive your shot it will disappear uh completely and you won't be able to locate it but now you can actually do it by doing this so check this out so guys welcome back so the first thing we're actually going to go through is for you to learn how to archive your message so the first feature is archive your message so uh this simply means when you archive your message if people have access to your shots they won't be able to actually see those shots that you have archived so you could actually keep them safe people don't have access to them and they can't see those shots only just you when you actually needed to see them so even when they send message now this new feature will not allow people or allow the message to pop up when they send message to you recently so let's check this out so the first thing you're actually going to do is to click on your whatsapp so then you you're going to click on the contact you want to archive so you can just hold the contact you click on it and hold it and the moment you hold it there will be an option for for you to archive it, this arrow is the option for archiving chat. Click on archive, you see this uh, uh this this stuff will come up on the top of your chat. So whereby you can actually see all the chats you archive, or you just don't want to see message from that contact entirely. So just put it on archive, archive the contact, and anytime you want to say you just click on it. So when you click on it, you could see the person's message. So even though this person sent recent message, it won't still pop up in your chat. So let's for an example the last message from slick is i so let's stick send another message to you right now so the other slick just sent a message to well to the other person now like hello how are you this will not show up in your chat so you can see that you can archive shite and will stay in your archive shite so you can reduce interruptions of chat and you can also turn it up when you want to turn it up so let's switch to the other whatsapp that you get a message so you switch to the other WhatsApp, you see you, the message didn't tow up, but when you click on archive, you see that hello, how are you is now there. So, but still it didn't come out in your chat. So at the same time, you can decide to go to the option, this option and archive settings. So archive chat will remain when you receive a new message. If you don't want that, you can unmute it. So when the message come up, it will show up in your normal chat. If you talk, uh, click this toggle button, this one means that your chats will show there, but once you click it up the shots will not show so that's it for archiving your shots with everybody so and if you want to on archive your shot you hold this bar uh, again and click on so once you click on it then you see stick is back on the normal shot so that's the first one stay tuned to the next one quickly i'm actually going to take you to this trick so this i call this the activating the invisible mode so i call this the invisible mode like a ghost mode whereby you'll be able to hide your shots reads and also you are able to hide your status views so nobody if you view your if people status people will not know that you view their status and at the same time if um you send message to somebody people will not know that you read your message it is also double tick without blue color so this is how to do it go to your settings as you show how click on the settings air and um click on this settings and go to your account go to your privacy and click come to read receipt so this is the invisible mode of of whatsapp so like a ghost mode so once i send message to people if you don't want to go friend your boyfriend you know that you read this or her message so just activate this and you'll not be able to then you too will not be able to know if they have read your message as well too so it's to 50 50 thing and also what you not be able to see the number of people that viewed your status so as when you're viewing people's status people will not know you're viewing their status so you can actually do it when you want to view people's status go invisible and once you're done about that you can go visible as well too so just click on this toggle button 
that's it so once you click on this toggle button you are invisible mode when you view status you will not be able to see that you have viewed their status so that's amazing i hope you enjoy it i'll see you in the next feature so welcome back to the next trick so this trick is actually for those people that just wake up one day randomly and say to hand you to a group that you're not aware of and you are not comfortable with so this is how to stop it from people that are adding you to a group you don't want to so just go to your settings as usual come to settings and go to prior account from account go to privacy from privacy come scroll down to groups so when you click on group it means like uh you can put everyone everyone can add you anyone anywhere you can put that only your contacts are eligible to add you to specific groups why you can even say my contact except these people can only add you to groups so that means that can add you to a group we have options of imp inviting you privately so you can just wake up and a random person just add you to a group you don't want so just click on only my contacts are eligible to add me to groups chat so just click on contact and click on done and that's it so people can add you to group or anyhow now and only your contact eligible to add you or you can even exclude most of your contact from adding you that's perfectly fine so there's an amazing tricks or cracks on whatsapp so yeah i call this one cracks so i'll see you in the next tricks welcome back guys so uh this next tips is actually for those people that want to send some personal private uh images or videos or whatever you want to send to somebody and you don't want the person to see it for long or maybe for a certain or you just want the person to view once and it disappears so here is the tricks that i'm actually going to give you today this is another a new feature that just came up on whatsapp so this trick is actually amazing so let's assume i want to send a picture to somebody so i'll click on this icon and i will click on the images i want to send so i'm picking on one of my images i want to send so i can just pick on a random image and i click on this image so once i click on this image you see i'm putting an option one this one on the right side of your button is it means the person can only view it once so i'm just going to click either his video or his image whatever you're going to send so just come to the right side of this where you see one time so this one means send photos and videos that can only be viewed once so once they view it disappear so for more privacy your photo or video will disappear from the chat after they spend open it once so remember people can always take screenshots so note that except people are just smart enough to take the screenshot even if they see it so but well, it's actually still safe on normal day you can just send picture to somebody and they will just disappear so if you want to prepare your girlfriend you just want to send it out see this fine picture once and it disappear or anybody else a family member or a private stuff that you want to send to them once so you can use this function so just click ok and send so you click on this one so it's showing so the, the video we're actually gonna send so once the person view this stuff once it will disappear once the person view so the person is showing one that the person is only saying bring in one so let's let's see how this works you can see the video right yes so let me go and read from the person's end so this is the from the person's end you can actually just see this video once so once the person click on this video and this person will see the video once yes so the person will see the video once like this so once the person see the video when you go to your own you will not be able to see it again so so once the person come back you see you can't open again because the person because i've opened it once it disappeared so it's so straightforward it's so good it's an amazing function so you can try it send a picture once or video of her once and the person will not be able to view it again that's what's up so see you in the next weeks So hi guys, here is a crack I made from WhatsApp, here is a crack I got. Now you can listen to a VM before sending it, so let's get started. Here is how you can listen to a VM if you made a mistake, you can delete it or before sending. So you go to WhatsApp in your chat, so when you get to your chat normal, you hold on the VM button. So when you hold on the VM, then you slide up so that the VM can stay while you're talking. So you keep talking and when you're done with your talk, you just have to press the back button. To listen to it or to delete it before sending it to the contact so just like i did now i click on the back button when i click on the back button i go back to the chat immediately so when i'm back to the chat then i will just play my 
stuff so you could see i'm listening to it now before i send it yes yeah, so you could just decide to delete it if you don't like what you said and if you like what you said then you could just click on send button and it was sent that's amazing so that's a cock from whatsapp that we don't have that fraction whereby you can listen to your vm before it gets sent so that's it i hope you enjoyed that so if you like give it a thumb up button see you in the next crack so um so the next tips or tricks uh, um, i'm actually going to take you through is how to create a to clone your whatsapp so that you can use two whatsapp on your device so let's get started so first thing you have to go to the, your phone settings you know how to slide down and go to click on your settings once you click on your settings just use the search button click on the search button and search for dual messenger so you can just type dual dual messenger so once you try to type dual messenger it come out and click on it once you click on dual messenger then just come down here to dual messenger click on it so once you click on it you can see whatsapp dual messenger apps that have dual messenger so basically you can do it for whatsapp snapchat facebook and messenger so you can once you activate the toggle button you click on it that means it will clone the whatsapp so you can see already using a dual messenger already so dual messenger we have this logo that is clone like this red background logo on the icon which means it's a clone whatsapp so that means you can use two whatsapp on your phone so just click on the toggle button and that's it if you want to create for facebook to just click on it and immediately it will tell you you'll be able to use a different account on facebook and you click on install just like the same thing so i've done it for whatsapp already so i won't want to do it so i can uninstall it if i don't want it again Facebook you see I've activated for both WhatsApp and Facebook so that's just an example of a trick if you want to use to WhatsApp apart from WhatsApp business on your phone and with different numbers of course you have to use different number so that is how you go about it just go to your settings search dual messenger click on dual messenger then click on the toggle button and activate to WhatsApp on your phone after you've actually activated the toggle button and do the installation so you can now go to your menu and go find them so go to your menu come to your menu and see this is it i am using it already you can see the difference between whatsapp and whatsapp clone with this logo and if you want to check out this is normal facebook and you go to you see the facebook clone with this logo so that's it it is what it is i hope you enjoy this yes i'll see you in the next trick <laughs> cheers amazing feature that you are not aware of is adding stickers yeah you've been doing some amazing stickers on whatsapp and you've been enjoying whatsapp stickers yes now it's time for you to use your own personal sticker so you can have a customized personal sticker and here is also i'm actually going to take you through how to have your own personal sticker and you can send it to people while you're shouting amazing stuff check this out hi guys so here is another final trick or oh, tricks that i'm actually going to give you to for today so uh um, let's get started so i'm actually going to teach you how to add stickers to your whatsapp chats like you've been sending stickers to people so you want to have your own customized sticker to your whatsapp chat so let's get started so the first thing you have to go and download sticker maker with this logo so make sure you go to your play store when you go to your head straight to your play store then when you get to your play store just search for sticker sticker maker so click on sticker makers and find the one that has this logo so this is the one you are downloading click on it and install it so once you install it then click on open and once you open it the first thing you have to do is to create a new sticker pack i've created one before so you just create a new sticker pack click on create then you can name it phone phone sticker you can name it phone sticker also you can put the name the name of the uh, of the creator is slick so and i click on create so once i click on create then click on the pack so once you click on pack then open this tray and click on the first one this is a tray icon you can create your create icon later you can create your first one so open your gallery open your gallery pick a picture so i'm actually picking this this picture so once i pick this picture then you could see so i will actually select uh, uh, a free you can do different one maybe a free i called you can do smart select or that but i prefer smart select because it will automatically draw it for me but freehand means you have to draw it yourself and all that you see this so you have to draw it so i really don't like freehand uh, sometimes so because you might not get exactly what you want sometimes so 
you see that that's freehand so you can try again if you don't get it you can use smart select you can see smart select will help you to select it auto you see amazing stuff so you see how smart select looks like so now i'm creating my sticker with that kind of high if you like don't subscribe don't subscribe to me you never subscribe so i can add a test and say my channel you can say you never subscribe to my channel you can put a cross question mark so you can actually reduce it you can click on ok here ok here yeah, you can give it a color you can drag it up you can drag it up you can reduce it now you can do a lot of stuff or you can just put it in the middle of it you never subscribe to my channel like in the middle of my plain shirt so this looks perfect like with that highlight like, you never subscribe to my channel so i'm telling you now click on subscribe or make sure you like and share and comment this on this video unless you're gonna see crazy <laughs> okay so when you're done just click on save click on save so when you click on save then you're good to go so just say add to whatsapp so this is it you can click on add to whatsapp so i'm adding it to your whatsapp that's just an advert so you click on close so pick on whatsapp you want to add it to so um, i'm adding it to my whatsapp my normal whatsapp i click on whatsapp add stickers to my whatsapp so it's already added to my whatsapp so now i need to go to my chat to go find out what phone sticker i just created and this is a sticker i created i'm going to be sending it to my contact so i'm heading straight to my whatsapp right now so i click on my whatsapp and i click on my chat so i go to my chat channel and click on this i um and i click on this icon yes so i find uh, this the sticker logo then i click on sticker logo so you see this is the new one i just created you can see for asterisk this is new so i click on it once i click on it i find my sticker so when i find it and i want to send it to one of my content i haven't subscribed to my channel i click on it and I say yeah you never subscribe to my channel with that high <laughs> okay amazing so that's how simple it is to create a sticker so you can actually create your personal stickers now with different pictures or even not your picture so you can create your own customized one and everything and that's amazing this is amazing trick tips so make sure you subscribe to my channel if you like if you enjoy this sticker creation i just did for you awesome story right this is the finer and the finer trick for now so make sure you stick around to watch the next fashion of tricks acts and cracks of whatsapp even plus tips as well too so i'm actually going to do more of this so make sure you stick around thank you once again for sticking to the head of these exciting tricks acts and cracks of whatsapp so make sure you hit the subscribe button as well as if you are like comment share to your network so that you could learn amazing stuff from whatsapp so this is the first version of this video set version 2 3 4 and all that will also be released soon so make sure you stick to this channel and see amazing video coming too awesome stuff so thanks again for watching i'll see you in my next video cheers guys Say no more, let's get started. So welcome back.